When most people think about the word Catholic, they are more than likely to think of massive cathedrals, breathtaking artwork, and intricate carvings and statues of supposed religious figures. Now we also know that when it comes to the practices of the Catholic Church, most of it is dictated by the commandments of the papacy, especially the Catholic Catechism. One controversy that is apparent when examining Romanism is the contradiction between the Catholic Catechism and the Bible with the Ten Commandments, as we can see that something has been altered in the Catholic authority to usurp the significance of the scripture. Let's go to the verse in question, as this is one of the commandments given to Moses by God. Exodus 20 verse 4 to 6. Thou shalt not make unto thee any graven image, or any likeness of anything that is in heaven above, or that is in the earth beneath, or that is in the water under the earth. Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them, nor serve them. For I, the Lord thy God, am a jealous God, visiting the iniquity of the fathers upon the children unto the third and fourth generation of them that hate me, and shewing mercy unto thousands of them that love me, and keep my commandments. What we just read was the second commandment given to Moses as found in the King James Bible. Now when we look to the Catechism in Part 3, Section 2, we see something changed. The second commandment has been removed. Let's read another verse from the same passage and see what else has been changed. Exodus 20 verse 17 Thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's house, thou shalt not covet thy neighbor's wife, nor his manservant, nor his maidservant, nor his ox, nor his ass, nor anything that is thy neighbor's. When we go to the Bible, we see that the last commandment given was not to covet. But in the Catechism, it's being divided so you get coveting a neighbor's wife as separate as for compensating for their lack of the second commandment. Although verse 14 is already devoted towards not committing adultery. Popery insists that their commandments are to be held over the words of scripture worshipping their creation more than the Creator in their idolatry. Paul, according to the book of Acts chapter 19 verse 26, persuaded those of Ephesus and most of Asia, saying that they be no gods which are made with hands. This serves as yet another reminder of how Catholicism is an apostate system that doesn't love God as they go against his words. In closing, let's turn to what Jesus said about those who place tradition over scripture. Matthew 15 verses 7 to 9 Ye hypocrites, well did Isaiah prophesy of you, saying, This people draweth nigh unto me with their mouth, and honoreth me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. But in vain do they worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments of men.